we shall chase these intruders down. I was chased by a gigantic bug. I think Lord Redgrave just suggested I was sired by an ancient vampire. Women die too in this war! Support- Good evening, Miss Ashbury. And good evening to you, Dr. Reed. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? A few days ago, I spotted a strange house while campaigning for women's suffrage. Awful smell. No answer when I knocked. Where is it? It's the Mullaney's. A nice family who live in a big house near the park in the eastern part of this neighborhood. Goodbye, Charlotte. Give my best regards to your mother when you see her. She's been quite busy these last... Good evening, sir. May I have your attention, please? Come on, Johnny. Don't you recognize your oldest friend? Clarence. Clarence Crossley. How are you? My God. So you survived the war, too. So sorry I didn't recognize you at first. I almost didn't recognize you, either. War does that to men, I heard. In my case, it was true, for... I witnessed the horror that lies underneath. How is your wife, Venus? We've spent so much time away from each other, and so many things have happened. But you're alive. You returned in one piece, and you have a family. How many soldiers can say the same? Believe me, it's not quite that simple. Like you, I'm not the man I used to be. Is everything all right at home? Surely Venus was relieved to see you return from France in one piece. If you forgot what people are like in this part of town, Johnny. Venus fears for our family reputation. Now her husband has become the village idiot. When did you escape the war and return to London? You know what's funny? I almost never think about the war. Not anymore. I'm involved in another kind of battle now. What is this new battle? Well, I saw terrible things during the war. Horrors I thought I'd forget. They're here too. They're everywhere. Vampires. I know what you mean. I haven't had much time to think about the war either since my return. Of course. With the epidemic, I bet you've been busy as well. Forgive me, Johnny. I, I didn't want to sound selfish. Do you need medical... It's a little late for... I will see... I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Can you help me? Infection is everywhere these days. But if you ever go to the park near that swanky house belonging to the, the Mullaney's... Yes? What about the Mullaney's? What about their house? Not enough noise for a big family with children. Not enough movement. Closed doors. What is going on in there? I wonder. You need some rest, Clarence. You should try to sleep. Why are vampire hunters sniffing around here? I need to find out what they're after. Thank <laughs> you. 
This woman's body has multiple lacerations. They're deep, too. Whoever did this was driven by rage. His tongue removed and his eyes gouged out. He was a victim of brutal torture. This one's neck is broken. He was young. Probably the son. your family. They mocked my talent! stage in the disease's evolution? <laughs> so 
So, this girl took lessons at the famous Doris Fletcher acting school. Good evening. And good... Goodbye, Charlotte. She's been quite... Good evening, old chap. I won't lie to you, John. You need some rest. Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am... I am... Karina Billow. I don't need any doctor. The rats. Where are the rats? Miss, you don't seem well at all. Are you afraid of rats? Has one bitten you? No. It's me who bites them. Tasty, juicy, disgusting rats. I... I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Infection. Infection. The rats carry it, I heard. Rats. 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 Many rats around that big house. Funny smell, too. Dead flesh. And where is this house? West of the park. Not very far. A, a big house with no sound, no light, no life left. Can I help you? The rat! I must go. Good evening, sir. Please forgive me for disturbing you. I'm a doctor. I never judge a man by his title, but by his attitude. And you are not disturbing me at all. I am Calhoun Russell, and I welcome you. Well, I must admit, it's good to receive a warm welcome for once. I'm Dr... I'm Jonathan Reed. Welcome, Dr. Reed. Welcome to my humble shop. I may have a look.
Sorry. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual? Not really. Wait, now that you mention it, I don't see the McPhersons in my favorite restaurants. They love delicate meals too, you understand. Thank you. It may be nothing, but I'll investigate anyway. Where do they live? They have a house in the southern part of the district, somewhere north of the railway bridge. There is a courtyard, if I remember rightly. Goodbye, Miss. Quarantine. Could this be what I'm looking for? It's locked, all right.
Thank <laughs> you.